and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 with the Middle Earth Project mod, where we are part of Durin's Folk. And um, yeah, we uh, are slowly but surely settling in. And uh, looking at my frame rate, it seems a big, massive war is happening because it dropped like a stone. Um, we're gonna take this one next because this should provide me with the most taxes. So look at these cities, uh, they give me a lot of tax. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. -do, 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 -do. Local tax here is 6.1 for okay. Okay. Then I'm gonna take this piece of territory here. Okay, okay, Lord Sauron likes us. Jesus Christ, and he's he is slowly conquering the world. I think that's a good thing that he likes us. Um uh, let's work on Saruman for a bit. That's not a dwarf. That's a human. Or a very stretched dwarf. Yeah, but... Um, looking at the way things are going, we... really... should watch Mordor here. And ish. I wish they stay slightly on that side of these mountain ranges so I can first conquer this entire territory and then move on to here. Or we die off before that and um, I made plans for nothing. Alright, start colonizing that. Did you? No. Currently to heal the troops. Look at there. Ugh. There we go. Okay. No. 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 Intrigue. Show Middle Earth decisions. Colonize him. Yes. Go for it. Um. Sure. Why not? Gives me some piety to love my wife. Why the hell would I not love my wife? It's my wife, you pricks. Uh, Jesus Christ. That's why it takes forever. Um, 23. That takes four months. Yeah, I keep sending them all they have. Um, I think it's the best idea. I don't know if, if there's a failure state that can trigger if you don't do it, uh, but I think it takes for sh fucking ever if you do it. I mean, if you don't do it. And hey, it takes about... Well, how long does it take? Ten years? Uh, a little bit less. A few years. Oh, great. So... That's 250 now. We're running a little bit of a budget deficit. Ugh. That's not what I was planning on. No, come on. Well, at least Sar Saruman likes me. Come on, convert you pricks. Good. Good, good, good. So, we've got more wars. Great. A little bit more tax. Wait, how does this, how did this dip? Oh, right, I don't have any trained troops anymore. Oh, right, our own, our own martial skill, of course, dropped. With nearly 10 points. Okay, start healing the troops there. That should increase the levy rate. Okay, um, the good burghers of Ballastar are barely able to pay their taxes. Our coffers are empty. Um, how would I ask that you lower taxes for your cities? Bribe him? Very well. Or. So, basically. We're gonna say some nice things and let him fuck off. Look, look, look. I really, I appreciate you coming here, but, um... No, I need the money. I need the money. <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> look, 
making. I'm, 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 not, I'm being stupid here. Okay, so the colonization was a success, so you can continue research economy tech. Was Ugh. I don't know what else you, you could do which has any use. You prick! Noble customs. This is me, people liking me, liking me, liking me. Monty piety and influence gain goes up to. Ooh. That's definitely the first one I'm gonna do. And castle infrastructure, castle tax, city tax, church we don't have. This is trade. We don't think I trade much. Well, that is actually useful, but um, so 300 points or. Ah, uh, we'll see. It's gonna take forever. We do not generate hardly as much points as I would like to. But hey, you gotta get work with what you've got, right? Alright, so we are gonna actually this time truly get you trained by Gimli. From beginning to end. Educate the child. Uh, my son by Gimli. Because he is a skilled tactician. He's got, oh, Jesus Christ, gluttonous, proud, brave, and wrath. But he is a great axe warrior. At least it's gotta be a lot better than being a tough soldier. Are you married? Oh, right, you were betrothed. Of the Duran folk. I still want a daughter. Give me my daughter! Uh, what are you doing there? Wait, whatever. Um, train troops. And. Heal the troops right there. So we should be... we're nearly full here anyway. We are full. <laughs> so training troops is... The levy size increases but quite a bit indeed. Uh, so, yeah, these are free but, you know... They... like here, you see... The, they have got a negative effect, actually, which is quite bad, but you need the inner fortification upgrade. And then you can upgrade it for a lot more money. But each time that we take a, uh, a province, we increase our income by such an amount that I've really first got to do that. This one is the next, once again, two cities that should bring in a lot of money. And, uh, yeah. So we're gonna focus first on this a little bit, then we're gonna take this province, do the same thing, and then I think I'm gonna focus a little bit more on getting soldiers. So increasing our towns and that kind of cool stuff. We still cannot have any levies. Hm, I know the kings could. Um, I'm wondering, if it's, is it just kings that can do levies? Because I'm not really, uh, not levies, um, retinues. Standing armies, basically. Uh, we got 11% of our top leash. We actually got 6... yeah. Betroth can marry? Yes. Oh, fuck, she got a must. I think that is the most disturbing thing about the dwarves, that their women got beards. It's really disturbing, though, me, because she, she's got... Just that massive fiery beard. <laughs> that again. Let's go to the barber. You look like an idiot. There you go. Anyways, you use bear somewhere near the case. Torin Achmu. 
What a, a, a courtier of mine has insisted to come along with my men and I were hunting for the bear. Well, you better. The bear, the beast was huge, bigger than any bear I've ever seen. I fought him bravely, but I only managed to slay him after he wounded several of my men. He gets the train wounded, or he likes me more. You already like me, don't you? Yeah. Hey, you know, you'll uh, thank me later. Yeah, I like that beard. Too bad I can't chase my wife's beard. My wife's beard. So my marshal should be pissed at me. You left me with a beard, you fucking prick! Wait a minute, we've got... That's surprising. Where in Heartland, right? That's... Wait, what? Okay, so this is how I normally do that. I take my vassals. Oh, wait, is, is, is the guy just in court? Alright, never mind. This is a court. I thought for a second we had a vassal that was. Why are we... We can demand him to be become a dwarf. Probably is the reason why it costs ten thousand piety to to demand it, because he, be he becomes a entirely different race. Um. Okay. Uh, but I think the wilderness is technically immortal. Gee. Is he? I don't know. Heck, I don't know. The guy, it's diplomatic modernness. You need to understand. That guy knows how to talk to other people. <laughs> it's the trees whispering to you, softly in your ears. Kill them! What? <laughs> Sorry, I'm being a bit of an idiot here. A bit. Quite a bit of an idiot. Um, bum, 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 bum. That's not gonna. It's gonna take a little forever to do stuff like that. I'm gonna go at speed 5. I don't really like the game at speed 5, but we're mainly waiting uh, here before we can go back to war. I'm gonna give this province to. No, I can't give it to my brother. Shit. That actually might be a slight problem here. Our king has... Shit. Right. Uh, he owns at least one, two, three, four, five, six... How does he have so many troops? I'm considered... 800 relative strength 12% of our top leash. We need to be able to field at least 3,000 troops. At least. So we're gonna need this territory. Um, absolute tribal organization. Oh, right, uh, legalism. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. A few more months here, and then we are gonna waste a lot of money. Alright, this day of are called Princess Elda, this is my wife. Etla, sorry. Attention, and after listening to us both, she settled the matter between me and the stable master in a fair way. I got the horse, and the stable master got the coin. Thank you, my dear wife. Yeah. I appreciate that. And uh, one more month? We should earn a lot more money than that. Um, right, we of course need to put you. Was it there? Shit. Uh, when can I move you? 
Uh, okay, we're going to move you in a half a year. No, we're going to wait. We are going to wait. Haters is going to hate. Taters are going to tate. And I don't really know any other words that... Um, deflate? You know, that's start, starting to sound stupid. Um, oh, right, we had our guy still there. Um, um, why don't we raise opinion with you? I don't know. You're some elven prick, King Cardane. He doesn't like me, probably because I'm a dwarf and you're an elf. Elf versus dwarf. Yeah. No, oh, shit, Armand's ticked over way quicker. Right, 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 colonize it, the shit out of it. Okay, nice. So I think in one video we did three provinces. No, we did two. I'll send them everything they need. I already earned 40 coins. Um, yes. I like that. I like that a lot. So we need about 150 more gold. And we've got the entire region here colonized. Okay. Well, that sucks. But we still got more than enough influence. We need one, two, four hundred. Yeah, we should be fine. I think we earn enough during the wars um, to get that back. Though, so what I have to do probably is maintain because of the way we've got we've got a primogenitor, right? Um, and that means that I can hold the both of the districts here, um, create it, and just feed the l these things to my not my son, but probably my brother. I want more kids, by the way. Is she past? Oh. Right, she might actually be past childbearing age. That means I need a divorce. Can I kill her? Uh, nope. Mm, well, we got a son. I think that is a good thing. But um, well, okay. Okay, just, you know, kick in, please. I want... How are we here? We're good here. So we're gonna move the two of you there. Come on, let's move. And we'll keep the colonizing guy there in case we really have to. And yes, we are... We don't go out. We started out with a little bit of money, a little bit of troops, and we are making... Almost twice as much now as we did before, and um, yeah, I think we're doing good. Fear is though, if I want to put myself on the throne, is that uh, perhaps these guys are gonna inter try to intervene? But you know, see that's the issue. He, he doesn't have only have yeah, he has a lot of troops. I'll give him that. That's probably because how high is his marshal? That's a lot. So if, they, if he dies, that marshal is going to di dissipate as well. Come on, kick in. I want to do this, this video if you don't mind. Yeah, we're going to take this. We're going to colonize the shit out of it. We're going to improve it. And then we are going to try to aim for the throne. Of these lands, your throne, to be honest. Declare war, dispose liege. Because I really don't want independence. That's stupid. No, I want to take your throne. There's far more important. 
and we've crashed. So that's the end of the video, and uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time. Have a good day. Bye-bye!